And we are back. This is episode 40, I think, of Biblin. Welcome, Bibblers. It's good to have you back. It's good to be back. It's been a long time since five minutes ago when we were recording the last episode. Um, yeah, good to have you with us. But yeah, we're back. Uh, we talked about it last episode. We're just going to plough through it, all right? So just, if you came for if you came for blathering fun... Go back and listen to the previous episode. <laughs> 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 Such a dark intro. No, I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> to all of our valued listeners, <laughs> fuck you. Like, <laughs> you're making us yeah. do this. No, okay. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, no, I didn't. I didn't mean that. That was uh, that was no. rude. I think because we're doing this bulk record, um, I do need to. I do need to remember that you know there has been a week between each episode for the fans, mm. and you know you probably shouldn't say fuck off to the audience within the first like eight seconds of the podcast it's an unwritten rule in podcasting that you should wait at least 30 seconds before um <laughs> before telling your audience that they're you know that they're cunts or anything like that like you should definitely <laughs> <Whoa>. <laughs> we it's just been more than 30 Amer- seconds American. so it's fine it's okay like, yeah we just lost all of our american audience it's okay there's it a little was... there's a little e for explicit next to our podcast for a reason yeah oh, okay yeah Get to fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> I actually didn't know we had that, so that's, that's good to know. Well, d- yeah. I, I hope it's there anyway. Yeah, I hope Those so. poor, poor Sunday students. Like, oh, <laughs> we've found a lovely podcast, children. It's where they read the Bible. And they give Two us a British lovely lads. minute by minute synopsis. Bible. Off you go. <laughs> Back up. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, yeah, let's just... Let's just crack on really, in it? Yeah. If any, if any random Bible stats or facts come to you, then shout them out. Otherwise, they're, they're we'll just, just not. <laughs> we'll they're just, just, just not going to. No, they're not going to. <laughs> not today. Now. It's not, not the, the day next, for it. Not for the next ten episodes, unfortunately, no. Biblin fans. No. Yeah. <laughs> just wait. Season two. We've got Genesis. Season Genesis two is be series great. two. You know, back with a back with oh, a vengeance or whatever it is. Two Genesis. <laughs> I don't know, anyway. Uh, we've run out of funny jokes, okay? We used them all already. Yeah, don't judge us. We're just trying to read the bloody book. Okay, yeah, you, try and, you try and, you know, get a podcast with 37 episodes in the bank. Yeah, and, you when know. you've got that, yeah, come come back to us. Send us that message. And we'll maybe read it on air, live. Not live. Well, it'll be live for us. Eight months in the past, yeah. or future, <laughs> or whichever way. One, One or two. Anyway, um, uh, is it me to start? You finished the last episode, so shall I? Shall I crack on? Um, did I? What are we on? Thirty nine. We're on forty. Forty. I lost it now. Um. You finished the last one, but you only did a couple, so I don't know if you want to. Oh yeah, yeah, that was it. Do you want to maybe do... Uh, I'm happy to just plough through and do the 10. Let's just keep going. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, cool. I'm happy with that. (laughs) (laughs) Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the King James Holy Bible, the first book of Moses called Genesis. Genesis 41. And it came to pass after these things that the butler of the king of Egypt and his baker had offended their lord and the king of Egypt. Oh my god, I love a story that starts with a butler and a baker. This yeah, can only go well. Baker? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's on his way, I'm sure. But anyway, so they've offended the king. Let's let's see where this goes. I'm expecting them to end up in a pretty sorry situation. Let's let's see. Genesis 42. And Pharaoh was wrath against two of his officers, against the chief of the butlers and against the chief of the ba- of the bakers. Genesis 43. And he put them in the ward of the house of the captain of the guard, into the prison, the place where Joseph was bound. We all remember Joseph. We didn't do it last time, but last time, Joseph, some stuff happened, ended up in prison. Next. Okay. Genesis 44. (laughs) And the captain of the guard charged Joseph with them, and he served them, and they continued a season in ward. Okay. So it's not the actual baker or or the butler who offended the the king it's the the chief of the baker and the butler who are in prison who makes candles on the side yeah we've all got to have he, a side he, hustle 
Nine. He moonlights as a candlestick maker. <laughs> we'll see that in a minute. Trust. I've yeah. got a prediction about this one. It's coming up. Genesis 45. And they dreamed a dream, both of them. Each man his dream in one night. Each man according to the interpretation of his dream. The butler and the baker of the king of Egypt, where, which were bound in the prison. Genesis 46. And Joseph came unto them in the morning and looked upon them. And behold, they were sad. Genesis 47. And he asked the Pharaoh's officers that were with him in the ward of his oh, lord. Oh, sorry, mate. Yeah. <laughs> just, I'm just sorry. Uh-huh. No, uh, you added a the. Oh, for unfortunately. Fuck sorry, lad. <sighs> Genesis. You added a the. I, I've got before a, Pharaoh. Hey, whatever King James says, I, uh, I'm his humble servant. What can I say? <laughs> Genesis 47. And he asked the. F- oh, f- that was you're it. There. It? <laughs> you're there. You're <laughs> uh, there. Genesis. At least you believe me now. <laughs> no, I do believe you. I, yeah, I, I thought you were faking, but now I, I, I do understand. Genesis 47. And he asked Pharaoh's officers that were with him in the ward of his lord's house, saying, Wherefore look ye so sadly today? Genesis 48. And they said unto him, We have dreamed a dream, and there is no interpreter of it. And Joseph said unto them, Do not interpretations belong to God? Tell me them, I pray you. Genesis 49. And the chief butler told his dream to Joseph, and said to him, In my dream, behold, a vine was before me. Genesis 40.10. And in the vine were three branches, and it was as though it budded and her blossoms shot forth and the clusters thereof brought forth rich grapes cool okay. is this um a vine with the little uh, little video clips yeah it is yeah that yeah thing. yeah i dre- dreamed a dream of the vine app yeah yeah cool <laughs> <laughs> way ahead of his time any yeah. whoever we're on about <laughs> Uh, Joseph? Is this Joseph? Yeah, it's Joseph. Who's the butler? Oh, this is the, oh, this is the butler. The butler Where's telling the Joseph. Maker? He's on his way. Cool, glad somebody's following along. <laughs> Genesis forty eleven. And Pharaoh's cup was in my hand, and I took the grapes and pressed them into Pharaoh's cup, and I gave the cup into Pharaoh's hand. Genesis forty twelve, And... Joseph said unto him, This is the interpretation of it. The three branches are three days. Cool. Just nonsense in that. Genesis forty thirteen. <laughs> Yet within three days shall Pharaoh lift up thine head and restore thee unto thy place. And thou shalt deliver Pharaoh's cup into his hand after the former manner when thou wast his butler. <laughs> <laughs> Genesis forty fourteen. But think on me when it shall be well with thee. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm gonna start that one again. Uh, Just cracked up halfway through. Genesis forty fourteen. But think on me when it shall be well with thee, and shew kindness, I pray thee, unto me, and make mention of me unto Pharaoh, and bring me out of this house. <laughs> 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 oh dear Genesis forty fifteen. for indeed I was stolen a stolen oh, bollocks to it Genesis forty fifteen. for indeed I was stolen away out of the land of the Hebrews and here also have I done nothing that they should put me into the dungeon <laughs> Genesis forty sixteen. when the chief baker saw that the interpretation was good he said unto Joseph I also was in my dream, and behold, I had three white baskets on my head. Genesis forty seventeen. And in the uppermost basket there was, of all manner of bake mints, uh, bollocks to it. Genesis 40. <laughs> bake meats. <laughs> yeah, bake meats. <laughs> Genesis forty seventeen. <laughs> and in the utmost basket there was of all manner of bake meats for Pharaoh, and the birds did eat them out of the basket upon my head. Bake meats. <laughs> bake meats. <laughs> <laughs> Genesis forty eighteen, and Joseph answered and said, This is the interpretation thereof. The three baskets are three days. Still doesn't mean anything. Genesis forty nineteen. 
Yet within three days shall Pharaoh lift up thy head from off thee, and shall hang thee on a tree, and the birds shall eat thy flesh from off thee. Shit. Shit me. <laughs> Genesis forty twenty, And it came to pass the third day, which was Pharaoh's birthday, that he had made a feast unto all of his servants. But he had a and big he, meal too. And he lifted up the head of the chief butler and of the chief baker among his servants. Um, I really don't know what the I, three baskets are three days means. So one of them is going to go back to his regular job after three days. And the other one is going to like die is that right it's gonna be have his head cut off do you think the baskets last three days is it like three days worth of food is that what that bit is no it's like symbolizes three baskets baskets, is three days so he's got three days to live Uh, and then he's gonna get hung because of something to do with baked meat (laughs) that bloody baked meat (laughs) Uh, uh, anyway, <laughs> Genesis forty twenty one, and he was, oh, fuck, I just completely. Oh, I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, I'll finish this one up, actually. We yeah? Looked looked a little bit ahead, we're very close to the end of this one. Oh, so. okay, go careful reading too far ahead, though, you don't want any spoilers. No, no, just the numbers. <laughs> oh, the only bit that I'm <laughs> noticing. That's a spoiler! <laughs> <laughs> the only bit that I'm noticing is the numbers. <laughs> Um, Genesis forty twenty one, and he restored the chief butler unto his butlership again, and he gave the cup into Pharaoh's hand. Forty Genesis forty twenty two, but he hanged the chief baker as Joseph had interpreted them. No, Genesis forty twenty two, but he hanged the chief baker as Joseph had interpreted to them. Genesis forty twenty three. Yet did not the chief butler remember Joseph, but forgot him. Don't forget him. No uh, one likes being forgotten. No. Um, um, yeah, we're done. Cool. There we go, people. Bye. Genesis <laughs> forty <laughs> complete. Uh, not uh, really much to reflect on on that. Some stuff happened. Baking. I'm yeah. really upset that there hasn't been the uh, candlestick maker yet. I thought that would have been cool. Because you got the baker, the what is it? The butcher, the baker, and the that's it. It's just a butcher and a baker. <laughs> Do you think it's more of a? This is like a recipe, like three baskets of grapes, uh, some baked meats, and like being held in a dungeon for like three days, and then hang it from a tree. What do you get out the other side? Like I don't know, mince pie or something. Uh, yeah, yeah. I guess bake bake meat could be. Um... Yeah, like uh, like Christmas. a pasty, like a Chris, like a like a Greg's pasty. Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> is it is it um, like flesh meat or is it like mince meat, like uh, raisins and that? I mean, I would, I know which way I would lean, but that's quite obvious to anyone who who knows any of my my back catalogue. Um, he loves killing animals. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 just not to eat oh, yeah <laughs> eating them are repulsive <laughs> <laughs> just for fun like yeah. fucking hell um yeah i reckon it's i reckon it's probably the meat version in it, it, it the probably bible's is. yeah they're bible's pretty, full of that they're pretty bloodthirsty at least for man flesh anyway so yeah um cool well i really need to pee so uh Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for listening, Bibblers. Uh, we'll we'll catch you in the next one coming right up if you have waited the week until the next one comes out. All right. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Nice one. Goodbye. <laughs>